Ashley Beckford here reporting for Infowars.com. I'm here at the end of the presidential debate. I'd like to know how this woman thinks that the debate went. What do you think about the debate that just went down? I think that uh, the race was close and it's no longer close. I think people who are in their right mind will be making the right decision and will be voting for Hillary Clinton. So you're saying that that right decision is actually to vote for Donald Trump because Hillary lied through the entire debate. Is that what you're saying? Are you really doing this to me? <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm playing with you. So you're a Hillary Clinton supporter is what you're saying? Uh, yes, I am. Okay. And what brings you to support Hillary Clinton after all of the vitriolic, disgusting comments she's made about black people, such as black young men are super predators? How do you feel about that? This is back in the 90s. Are you aware of the comments that she made where she said black males were super predators and they need to be made to heal? No? Really? I mean, it's okay if you haven't heard of it. I'm just, I'm just trying to ask, like, what you think about Hillary Clinton's past of just supporting a lot of seriously racist people. I think I've given, I will not give you permission to present this on the internet. Okay. So what do you think about the debate then? No comment. No comment? So what brought you here? Just to support Hillary Clinton? I think it's time for me to go. It was nice meeting you, though. I didn't actually meet you. What was your name? All right. Well, there you have it. We have someone here who is supporting Hillary Clinton, a lovely black woman. She would not provide to me any information as to why she's supporting Hillary Clinton why she's ignoring her blatant racist past. She's not giving me any info whatsoever. She's just one of the people who's blindly supporting Hillary Clinton. She doesn't know why. And if she does know why, she's not willing to share it with us. It's really, really shocking and it's really, really disturbing. I'm sorry to have to present this to you, but I will have to. I'm going to ignore her plea not to put this on the internet. She shouldn't have stopped if she didn't want her opinion spread on the internet, uh, which was basically that she loves Hillary Clinton and she has no idea why. Americanism, not globalism. Look, I'm not going to sit here and say, see, I told you so, that communist Chinese style net censorship was coming to the web because it's already here. It's being announced. The way you keep the internet open and free is you get involved more than ever. You don't let them break your will. Go to Infowars.com forward slash app and download an app that cost us over $200,000 and took us over a year to develop that we're going to be expanding on the next few months with free video and audio and podcast feeds and breaking news and alerts and so much more. Don't sit by and let the internet and free speech be stolen from you. Take action.